hi friends uh, this video is about rules engine so uh, this uh, uh, rule engine is very important uh, uh, part of uh, itsi so before i start <clears throat> there are few few things which uh, uh, we should know before uh, start about the rule engine uh, first is correlation search and uh, another one is neep notable event aggregation policy so uh, correlation search uh, generally we use in itsi to find out any notable events are there in system or no for example uh, if uh, your memory utilization is high or cpu utilization is high so you create a notable and uh, uh, notable that 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 gives you uh, an kind of uh, alert uh, that uh, you want to act on that alert or no and and uh, neep uh, notable event aggregation policy is club uh, group all similar kind of events into a single episode uh, so episode is a kind of a, a grouping of similar kind of incident or we can say uh, it, it correlates uh, all the event together and uh, a former episode so this is uh, a, a functionality of neep so neep also has uh, uh, actions uh, if you want to perform any action on uh, on episode so you can uh, do uh, action like uh, sending an email creating a ticket uh, uh, pinging a particular host or or uh, running a script or some other things so these are the basics about uh, correlation search and uh, uh, notable event now let's come to the rules engine so this is we can say it's a heart of uh, itsi uh, uh, itsi uh, framework so uh, let's begin with uh, the overview of uh, rule engine so the itsi uh, rule engine is a system for continuously processing notable events to allow for event grouping and deduplication as well as automatic action execution based on the user defined criteria okay this is a definition very straightforward so where the uh, rule engine is a system for continuous processing the notable event so uh, notable events as i mentioned that uh, correlation search will create a notable event and uh, and uh, rule engine will help to group it together and process it deduplicate it and uh, also uh, it helps to automate uh, it helps to automate the action execution and 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 those will be on the basis of ex uh, user defined criteria so so uh, user can define any any action like sending an email as i uh, uh, explained earlier or any other action the system revolve around a continuously running indexed real time search that stream all notable events into a custom search command so uh, there is a, a index call uh, ITASI uh, tracked alert tracked alert all the notable events uh, uh, go to the uh, go to the, those tracked alert and uh, also uh, it 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 uh, it uh, uh, gets that tracked alert into uh, uh, as a as an input for ITSI rule engine and uh, work upon it and do all the all all kind of uh, actions so the, the next part is uh, uh, rules engine uh, rules engine search so as i mentioned the the rules engine engine is nothing but a real time search real times is continuously uh, run uh, take uh, events from the tag track alert event as in it's a notable event and so where the cpu and memory utilization is high and and uh, this it's not a simple event it's notable event and 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 those notable event go to itsi rule engine as uh, as this is mentioned over in in the search and and also it it perform uh, 
grouping create episode and uh, and do uh, the things which which is required to grouping together so this is this is a typical search uh, for it uh, and, and 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 this is uh, a macro you can see it's a macro uh, so it's nothing but uh, it, it 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 has index equal to itsa tracked alert uh, written over there so this is a, a, about itsi search so uh, so so the itsi uh, rule engine search is a, a component that group notable event into episode based on the filter criteria you define in the aggregation policy and the the search runs with a time range early is equal to uh, right and latest is equal to rt it includes index real time is equal to 1 to focus is plunk to stream all newly indexed event directly to the custom search command uh, uh, that is called custom search command called that is uh, itsi rules engine and and uh, finally it has a where clause uh, ensure uh, the output of a search command doesn't uh, linger in the uh, dispatch directory okay so this is about uh, uh, rule rule engine search so this is a real time search it, it continuously runs uh, uh, run um, in background uh, real time so it always search for the notable events so uh, next one is about how the rule engine works uh, so 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 a, a notable event policy is a fundamental unit of of a, a rule engine a aggregation policy are the data structure uh, structure the the rule engine uses uh, to group a notable event into episode it also uh, contains for action rule engine that autom automates episode action okay such as uh, uh, sending an email and and, and everything I am repeating again and again. Uh, so uh, let's let's just move how the rule engine works. Uh, so <clears throat> the rule engine functions uh, begin with the correlation search. Now we we will uh, uh, discuss it uh, through uh, a diagram. So so this begins with the the correlation search. Uh, correlation search generate a notable event uh, in itsi as i, I earlier mentioned that uh, it generates uh, notable event in itsi which are stored in itsi <coughs> tracked alert so this is the index the, uh, the the notable events comes over here over here the rule engine save search accepts the notable event into itsi rule engine custom command so itsi rule is, is I, I earlier mentioned uh, that uh, <coughs> accepts the notable events into itsi uh, rule engine command uh, through save search uh, the search command generate uh, uh, the internal structure required to aggregate uh, aggregating event into episode and execute events so so that command uh, as i earlier mentioned this command this command structure the data so that uh, the event can be grouped together and perform a particular action over it so this dispatch or any other action actions are there so uh, episodes are stored uh, episodes are stored via HEC so it call HTTP event collector HEC to grouped alert index so here this is called a grouped alert index so so the episodes will be stored over here so so index uh, for this is itsi underscore grouped underscore alert so this is the index for grouped alert if you want to search for it uh, for a specific uh, uh, grouped uh, events or or for the episode so you can find it in itsi grouped itsi underscore grouped underscore alerts okay so for 
uh, for notable event uh, for notable uh, event uh, uh, it is called itsi the index called itsi underscore tracked underscore alert for group it's itsi underscore group underscore alerts okay so after this means uh, through it goes means through hec the the group event goes to index grouped index uh, all the episode metadata is stored via rest uh, events uh, to the kv store so the kv store uh, uh, the kv store name is itsi underscore notable underscore group underscore system so this is with respect to system and for the user it goes to itsi underscore notable underscore group underscore user kv store collection so these are the name of collection i will uh, give the details of all the things index and 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 uh, the kv store collection used in uh, in it in uh, by the rule engine i'll put it in comments so so here we we uh, have now we have uh, events grouped together in into the index and we have a metadata metadata or user user uh, related data uh, into the kv store the rule engine search periodically polls the configuration database updates if a policy indicates some action should be executed the rule engine dispatch a rest request to the event management interface to execute the action okay so it searches uh, also the rule engine searches whether there is any action defined or no so if any action defined it uh, dispatch those action to event management through event management uh, rest api and then ex action will get executed so the action can be anything if it can be ticketing or 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 any other other things so as as uh, you can see that the uh, the blue line is typical uh, itsi functionality and then the uh, and the other things uh, other things are are splunk enterprise so so this this is like hec index episode stored kv store and uh, searches index save search is part of enterprise uh, enterprise but uh, enterprise splunk but these are uh, combinedly the, the functions for uh, the itsi rule engine so uh, for the basic understanding of itsi rule engine and how it works i have defined it in this video uh, in upcoming video i'll uh, i uh, will try to uh, talk about uh, the properties of uh, uh, rule engine or the other advanced uh, configuration for the rule engine so thanks for watching the video and uh, have a good day